Bishop Patrick Wooden here, Bishop of North Carolina Third Jurisdiction, and I am excited to do yet another segment of Good Things Happen at NC Third. We're so proud of what the Lord is blessing us to do, and I have with me today a young lady whom I simply admire, I revere. She's a tremendous woman of God. She's a businesswoman. She is an achiever and making great things happen uh, in the world of business, uh, with her family, in the kingdom of God, and yes, in NC Third Ecclesiastical Jurisdiction. Her name is Kenya Bogier, and she just got back from a trip on yesterday down uh, in the Jacksonville, Wilmington area, helping the saints who had been adversely affected by uh, Hurricane Florence. Now, I know that the cameras and the, and the, uh, the media has somewhat moved on, but the, the suffering and the pain is still there. It's real. And this woman of God and uh, her, her, her family, her family business, her mom, uh, they, they decided that they wanted to help. I'll give you just a little short story. Uh, during our women's convention uh, back in September, when they heard about a family that pressed their way to the convention, even though just a week prior in their home, uh, the, 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 the furniture was floating because of the storm, right. when they heard about these people, they wrote them a check for thousands of dollars to help them, and listen to this, they never met these people, never had conversation with them, but saw a need and met the need. And then called me and said, we want to do something working with NC Third. We want to deliver literally thousands of dollars in goods, in, in, the, in supplies, in gift cards. We want to go down and pass out these things to help people in need. And listen, I've talked enough. I want to introduce you to Kenya Borgia. Kenya, yes. thank you so much. Yes, thank you for coming. Yes, Would you share with our, our audience there the things that, that, you, that took place yesterday yes, and all of the good blessings that you all provided for the people? Yes, sir. So I'm Kenya Bogier again. I work at Bogier Clinical and IT Solutions. This is our 22nd year in business. We're Retha Bogier. My mother is the CEO. Mm -hmm. So yesterday we went down and we were able to provide $35,000 in supplies at Sam's. Wow. And also we gave $10,000 in Target gift cards. Mm. And so um, as the people came through the line, we were able to pass them a gift card and however many families were represented in that card, we're able to give however many gift cards with $50 on them. Wow. Um, so we had um, anything from toilet paper, mm -hmm. um, paper towels, mm -hmm. um, lotions, mm -hmm. deodorant, mm -hmm. air mattresses, um, wow. bleach so wow. they can clean their homes wow. um, effectively. And we were able to help a lot of people. Wow, to God be the glory. Now you mentioned to me that you got a U-Haul and yes, sir. and, and the, the, you, you yes. had trouble gathering it all? Yes, sir. We got two U-Hauls. Um, Superintendent Perry was there to help us. He provided us truck drivers and we got the biggest U-Haul you could get. And um, <laughs> we got it all full, but we almost didn't have enough room. I wow. mean, we had a lot of people help us mm. down, even in the Sam's in Jacksonville. Mm. Um, Superintendent Roland came with an elder of his. Um, uh, we had people on the ground in Jacksonville. I want to say too Jesus. that there are people there that That's were right. willing to help yes. and um, were so excited about God has blessed us to give back. Mm -hmm. And wonderful. so they were excited to hear that people were getting blessed and they were able to help us prepare and plan and so that that day could go effectively. About how long were you down there? We were down there from, whew, from 10 to maybe seven o'clock. Mm -hmm. So we were, it was, it was an all day event. 10, 10 a.m. <laughs> to 7 p.m. To, to 7 p.m. Yes, wow, sir. that's all day. Yes, sir. Praise yes, the sir. Lord. Praise the Lord. And I know uh, what you mentioned, Superintendent E.A. Perry, Correct. Superintendent Ronald Rowland. Correct. I know that they were very appreciative yes. and, and they had had staff on hand to yes, help sir. unload and to load. Yes, sir. It was, well, by the time we got there with both of our U-Hauls, um, there was a flood of people from Superintendent Parish Church willing mm. to help and lend mm. a hand to unpack and to help us set up 
um, for the line that was coming. And it was a lot of cars as well. Well, I'll tell you, I, I thank God for you. Yes. I thank God for your thank mom. You. I thank God for your family, business, and the generosity of these people. I said to Kenya uh, when we were back in the office, many people, when they don't have the means, have the mind. Right. But the thing that have made uh, these people special is when God blessed them with the means, yes. they kept the mind to provide for people, to be a blessing. And many times the blessings are for people that they perhaps will never see again, will right. never meet. Right. But the word of the Lord and the work goes on. Yes, sir. Thank you so yes, much sir. for sharing with us. Yes, and she is yet another example. She's living proof that good things happen at NC3. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm.